good morning guys welcome back to my channel it's another beautiful beautiful day in my village i mean at, in my parents house actually and it's another beautiful and amazing day guys i'm so tired i really had a lot of work to do guys and today we are still going out with my mom over here so as you all know my mom has a small business here in the village and she has a small shop here in the village whereby she sells some small small stuff you know like the daily things just with kidogo yeah so today we are going to the market with my mom uh to restock uh to top up or to restock let me say that and we've restocked like how many times mm, i can't really count and actually that means actually the business is doing good the business is doing good so we are going to restock again we are going to get some more stock for her and we were just doing some calculations her calculations and i was doing mine you know just to make sure the business is running smoothly okay so yeah you come with us to town as we shop for uh, as we restock or as we go for shopping in her you know her shop is not a new shop anymore and so far so good let me ask my mom how business is doing so far so good i will show you the shop uh, when we restock when we fill up everything because uh some things we are supposed to fill up and let me ask mom so this is my mom for those who don't know hello you guys <laughs> i am yeah. here with my daughter marika mm -hmm. yeah so mom uh this is not an interview i just want to ask so far how is business uh, business is doing well. Business is doing and, well. Yeah, uh, doing well. I'm mm -hmm. um, just appreciating. You are appreciating. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So even me when I'm here, like I see she sells actually, and this business is also also helps the community. Yeah. I'm not gonna talk much about that, but is it is a business, but it is also something that we decided to put to help the communities or the neighbors around. Eh? Yeah. Yeah. And so far so good. It's doing well, Cindy. Doing well. It's doing well. Yeah. Uh, when you see us restocking, it means we are selling. It means like things are going. Yeah. Yeah. So are you happy with your business? How you feel I being am. an entrepreneur? Let me call you that. I am happy. I am happy. I am happy. Mm -hmm. Still appreciating. Uh, yeah. 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 So that's it. Mm -hmm. So we are going to the market. I'll show you how it goes, guys. And I'll show you what we'll get. And I'll show you the shop, how it is mm -hmm. later on, okay? So mm -hmm. we are waiting for our motorbike. And we'll be back. Actually, we do shopping in town. That is where we buy stuff in wholesale. Mm -hmm. Here in the village, you cannot get. So it's about an hour from here. So we'll be back by then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So stay tuned in. And subscribe. We are road to 50,000 subscribers. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you and subscribe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So every time before we go to buy things, my mom does her calculations very, very well. Just to make sure we are making some profits. And this is her doing final calculations before we leave for town. And she just wants to make sure, like, uh, she writes down, like, everything. So it's now time to get ready we are very simple people no one my mom is almost ready myself i'm almost all ready as well like i don't really do makeup especially when i'm in the village uh it's just simple like just as long as you're clean we are preparing as we catch up as we are also waiting for a motorbike person because we've called someone who takes us to town uh, the most common mode of transport here is motorbike motor or motorcycle and you also have like a matatu so depends on what is convenient for you and that is what you use so this is me getting ready putting shoelaces in my shoes as i'm waiting for my mom to also finish up you know how women take long to prepare yeah i'm waiting for my mom to finish up before we can leave and go get some things and good thing is that we already know what we are getting we have a list of everything that we need to buy so it's going to be very easy for us just go pick 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 and then come back home yeah
this is where we buy things from. This is like a wholesale shop. It is big actually. It has a big storage area from the back side. So this is where like you come, you pay for the things and then you wait for them to remove the things from the store for you. So this is my mom and I waiting here for our turn. Sometimes it's usually like crowded, but on this particular day, we are very, very lucky the place is not crowded. As you can see, like uh, people are not so many because usually the other days, the place is usually very, very full. And now we are ready with our things and the things have been removed outside. So we have a motorbike that is going to tie up everything that needs to be taken home because uh, mo mostly, as I mentioned earlier, the most common mode of transport that we use here is a motorcycle. And or if you're buying in bulk, you can use a pickup. It depends on what you're buying, but a motorcycle can also carry like a lot of things. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so these are our things. You are going to arrange them and then, you know, off we go. Sometimes when you have a very reliable person, transport person or a motorbike person, you can as well send them in case of going there yourself. But uh, in case you wish to go there by yourself, you can also go. Like you just have to get one person to do everything for you. And for us, we have that one person who does everything for us. And yeah. Sometimes we go, sometimes we just send him. <laughs> Guys, people are wondering if I'm crazy or not. So we are now done. We are going home. Uh, my mom is going home actually. I still have some business to take care of. I'll see you guys later. I'm sharing a cooler. Sorry, sorry. And side. side so we had to take another motorbike you know like how this motorbike people can insist like oh there's more space there's more space i saw the thing was like full but the guy was insisting no there's still more space so we decided to just get a different motorbike for my mom so that she can go home comfortably it's a bit costly but better safe being safe than you know wandering and this is the town of bungoma county this is how bungoma looks like let me give you a mini vlog so guys, I decided to give it a try and vlog in the streets of Bungoma and it's crazy, it's mad crazy. <laughs> a lot of people and a lot of stairs, just look at that, people are wondering what I'm doing but it's not very very crowded but this is me finally facing my fears and vlogging in the streets of Bungoma, my hometown. But I'm using the pavement because the kind of the main road is very very busy. So it's now time to stop because I can't keep up. Yeah. <laughs> it's not as hard as I thought anyway. So I also had to pass by this bookshop and get my son some things. He wanted an atlas, a mathematical table, a calculator, and yeah, so I had to pass here. This is the bookshop that I buy the things from. I find it very, very affordable, and at least they guide you on what to buy because I didn't come with him, and it's been some time since I left school. So they are using like a bit different th things from the ones that we used back then in school. So after this, I go to the supermarket market yep. yep look what i came across just found this nice set of these utensils small utensils that we decided to buy for chanel eh? i was looking for a calculator my son needs a calculator as well so i've just bought him an atlas and a mathematical table but i was looking at different prices for the calculator so i decided to come here the supermarket check and I got these nice things for Chanel. I know she'll love them, eh? Because whatever she's playing with are uh, empty containers of yogurts and everything. So I, I, I thought like these ones are looking nice, so I'm taking I'm taking for her. 
I'm taking them. I'm buying them for her. Yeah, this one. <laughs> yeah, so. And that's a day in my life, guys. That's a day in my life. Uh, it has been a good day. I'm a bit tired. I'm so tired. It has been a very, very busy week for me. But I thank God at least the things that I wanted to do, they are coming into place. It's bad hair season for me, bad hair week for me. But I'm going to fix my hair. Maybe by the end of the week or next week, in the beginning of, of next week. So what I've realized today, guys, is that things are expensive, eh? food everything books things are, are are now expensive like um <clears throat> you go to buy something today when you go back the, the next following day or two days or a week later things are even like others are even double the price you bought them eh? so things are very very expensive and i understand it's not only in kenya so i don't know what you'll do but we still have to survive so we just have to work so harder and to pray for this economy to stabilize okay so yeah i was checking at this atlas this is like history the atlas is so big the one that i just bought for alloys it is so big like i didn't know as when we were in school it wasn't this big it was just something small but this one is heavy with many pages and so many details inside anyway i think we are growing old eh? we are growing old anyway it's been some years ever since i left high secondary school and this is just uh the space that we do like our shop usually we don't put everything outside here like we put some small things and then when they are finished we get some other things from the house we put them here we still haven't organized the place very well but this is my mother's small space this is where she sells from and this is what we call our small shop back in the village yeah Good morning guys, welcome back to Malika Kenya. It's yet another beautiful, beautiful morning on my side guys. I really thank God for today. I really thank God for each and every one of you who are watching this video. I'm just doing a video a day in my life and i have some bags some cute bags that people want and today is the day that i get to do deliveries yeah we had a mother's day giveaway and people want some cute nice african handbags and i'm going to do the deliveries today most bags um yeah i'm going to do the deliveries so those people who want the bags sent me their information except one person who did not reach out so i don't really know uh maybe they will watch this video and reach out so i'm going to like um send the bags to them to everyone who won uh, at least those people who gave me the details on how to send the bags and i'm very very happy i'm gonna show you a day in my life i'm gonna show you in my town how it looks like and yeah you're gonna see how it looks like so um let me show you the bags guys so these are the bags and this is what i use because most of them are not going far just going to nairobi this is where i i use these ones and then like i staple them so that uh before sending them so this is everyone's bag so yep all this all these are going all these are going all these are going guys and yeah so i'm gonna package them in one thing and then i leave the house send them make sure everyone gets their bags this is where i'll package from let me show you these are the packaging bags this is what i use and i staple on top and then i send it by tomorrow everyone will have gotten his or her bag if you get your bag please comment in the comment section below if you got your giveaway bag okay yeah Yeah, and this is my outfit of the day. No, it's a bit dark, but this is what I'm wearing today. Yep. <laughs> running errands in Bungoma. I'm going to send like the last package. 
yeah, it's very, very hot. I think it's gonna rain later on. So I'm using Easy Coach for this particular one. The customer had requested for me to use Easy Coach. Yes. Decide, uh, decided to pass by the supermarket and buy a deodorant for myself. And <laughs> just look at those prices. Anyway, we have to survive. No matter what, we shall survive. These prices have doubled from what they were. So, guys, I decided to stop here at my joint to have something. I'm done with the errands. <coughs> and nowadays, I don't like like going eating out so i just buy takeaway <laughs> because i'm tired i'll go to eat from home yeah when i'm relaxed when i am relaxed so this is the joint that i come to here in the village and it's just a nice simple place i love it because it's usually not crowded and it's hidden yeah so this is where i buy whenever i want to treat myself a little bit i come here yeah I love it here. So guys, uh, I got pizza and uh, we really enjoy. I really enjoyed that pizza. I'm telling you, I was so hungry. I really wanted pizza and that's what I got. These videos, I shot them some time back and I forgot to share them with you. But I decided like to join them and share them as one video. So thank you so much for watching. Please give this, uh, give this video a thumbs up and see you on the next video.